We're actually sitting around again waiting for our third delivery, which is uh, a little bit frustrating, but the last two days we've just absolutely nailed it. Yesterday was a fantastic day. As you can see, we, we got all the roof on. So we've, the house is basically 24 metres long. And uh, as of about 3.30 yesterday afternoon, we've, uh, we've completed uh, 17 and a half metres of the house. So uh, ground floor walls, floor system, upper walls, and yeah, we got the roof on. We actually also got the, um, the structural steel portal frame at the back here, which was awesome. So uh, it's been a very eventful morning this morning. So um, I think it's getting close to 11 o'clock. Um, we had a late start with the cranes this morning, so we come in our normal time, 6.30, and uh, got the front of the house set up, ready to go. So um, got all our fixings organised, all of our packers to sit the panels on, had a clean up of the site. Uh, the crane rocked up, but we, we thought it'd take an hour to move the crane from the back to the front. And like everything, this job just keeps giving and giving. So uh, I think it's gonna be one of those ones that are gonna go right through to handover. It's just gonna be, uh, constant little things we got to battle with but the uh, the crane got bogged so um, we spent basically three hours this morning I actually had to bring my F truck down the side of the house with my winch and uh, give him help to get out we had to move him backwards and forwards a million times we actually used uh, we had a heap of timber in the backyard all of our profiling uh, we had a, a quite a bit of new timber formwork we actually had to cut it all up jam it in the ground and We'll show you some shots of the backyard. We um, we didn't get too much footage of it actually happening because it was a bit of a bit of a uh, ha all hands on deck to um, get him out. But the backyard's an absolute mess at the moment. Is it? And now we've got a heap of firewood. So, <laughs> um, but yeah, he's, he's out the front now. We've just finished setting him up. We're just waiting on our third delivery. Uh, the front of the house is a lot more straightforward. There's a lot. Um, there's nowhere near as many walls. And so I'm really hoping that uh, in the next three days we'll complete this installation. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely, I'm in love with this product. Like this job has given, has tested us, but that's just all part of being, it's, a, it's the first one we've ever done. It's the it's first time a residential house on this sort of lot has been built out of this product. So we've overcome so many challenges. Everyone, my admin team in the office, my wife, uh, supervisor, the architect, uh, XLAM, our crane company, the site team, everyone's just absolutely killing it. They're all, uh, everyone's working together. Um, and one big thing that's come out of all the issues we had here last week, um, like XLAM is so passionate and obviously want to do a lot more of these buildings and, and bring it into the residential market. So um, we're all, we're there, um, they come and did a site visit on Tuesday we're talking through them with a lot of things and I, I actually think it'll, we'll probably have a meeting at the end of this job and sit down, we'll do a debrief and we'll talk through all the challenges we had and what needs to be done to improve it next time with uh, panel sizing, uh, the size of the loads on the trucks, um, craneage, fixings, like the fixings on this job and the engineering have uh, played a, quite a big role in, a, in quite a few of the issues we've been having. Um, so we'll do a full debrief, full review, we'll work through it um, and next time it's just going to be, it'll, it'll be so much better, like it's, um, it's really exciting, I'm, I'm so excited about it, I, I love the look of it, um, there is a lot of sanding and a lot of prep work to be done but I cannot wait to show you the finished product of this home because it is just going to be absolutely sensational, the, this pine, the CLT panelling, with the joinery we have going in, the beautiful uh, recycled hardwood floors, the tallowwood cladding on the outside of the house, the, the copper cladding. It's just gonna be absolutely smick and I, uh, I can't wait to show you it all coming together.